Obama tells 60 Minutes Hillary Clinton made email mistake President Obama on Sunday called Hillary Rodham Clinton's use of a private email server a mistake, but said it had not endangered national security and had been ginned up into a political attack by Republicans eager to keep her from being president. Mr. Obama made the comments during an interview on CBS's 60 Minutes program in which he also defended his policy in Syria during a lengthy, contentious exchange with Steve Croft. A veteran correspondent, Mrs. Clinton's use of the email server during her tenure as Secretary of State has become the centerpiece of Republican-led investigations into the 2012 attacks in Benghazi, Libya, that killed four Americans. She is certain to face questions about the emails during Tuesday's Democratic presidential debate and later this month when she is set to appear before a House committee in the interview which was taped Tuesday and broadcast Sunday evening. Mr. Obama called those questions legitimate and said, without directing the comments specifically at Mrs. Clinton, that public officials in high office should know better, as a general proposition, when we're in these offices. We have to be more sensitive and stay as far away from the line as possible when it comes to how we handle information, how we handle our own personal data, Mr. Obama said, and, you know, she made a mistake, she has acknowledged it. The president said Mrs. Clinton could have handled the original decision better and might have been quicker to disclose work-related emails that had been kept on a private server outside government control. Mr. Obama said her possession of the email server is not a situation in which America's national security was endangered. He declined to say whether the email controversy was not that big a deal, but he chided Mrs. Clinton's critics for their single-minded focus on the issue. The fact that for the last three months this is all that's been spoken about is an indication that we're in presidential political season, he said. On Syria, Mr. Obama acknowledged the failure of his $500 million mission to train and equip as many as 5,000 fighters in the battle against the Islamic State. The president said he had long been skeptical that the program could create an effective proxy army, but tried it anyway in an effort to confront what he called the difficult problem for the entire world community.